well it is friday face mask time and the face mask in question this friday is this it's by generation clay and it is a brightening purple clay mask let's get it on hi there guys and welcome back to my channel or just welcome if you are new here today's video it is friday face mask time <laughs> Yes, it is that time again. I'm really getting into my face mask at the moment, which is fantastic. So the next mask on our list to do is this. So this is by Generation Clay and it's an ultraviolet brighten and purple clay mask. So this one is 50 mils that you get in here. Um, I will link this mask down below if you are interested um, and we'll see if it's any good really. So yeah, let's pop this open and have a little look. So there it is there. It is your typical clay mask look. Uh, although it is just has a purple tone to it. It smells really, really nice. It smells gorgeous, in fact. Yeah, let's pop this on our face. But first, let's have a read just to see how we use it. Um, so it just says, apply an even layer to clean, dry skin. Wait approximately 10 minutes or until the mask starts to tighten. Use water to gently rinse off the mask in circular motions, then lightly pat dry. So again, nice, easy, simple instructions. Let's get it on. Right, so just going to be using my little spatula here. Try and keep things as clean as possible. Um, but let's see how we go. Just a little bit of information about the mask. It just says, looking to add radiance to your skin sans makeup. Our Generation Clay Ultraviolet Bright Purple Clay Mask has got your Australian Source Superfruit. Davison Plum, a gentle natural version of skin exfoliating alpha hydroxy acid, AHA. The hard working beauty hero helps to rejuvenate dull, tired skin while brightening dark circles and pigmentation. The result is a radiant and more even complexion. The benefits of this mask is that it restores, reducing free radical damage and slows down the aging process. It illuminates, boosting hydration and collagen production. It brightens, rejuvenating dull, tired skin and fades dark spots. Um, it refines, reducing oil and minimising the appearance of pores. Right, so there we go. Mask is on. So like it says, we're going to leave it on for 10 minutes or when it starts to tighten. So I'll be back soon. It's definitely feeling tight. As you can see, it's changed colour. It's still dark in places um, and it started to crack. There you go. <laughs> so it's definitely, definitely a time to take this off. So I'm just going to be using these today. These are my Rayma sponges. I will link these down below if you're also interested in purchasing these. These are so affordable and they can be reused time and time again. You just pop them in the washer. Um, but yeah, so they are dry at the moment and they are rock solid. But when you add water, they go to a lovely spongy consistency. Um, but I like the way that these work because when they're dry, they don't collect germs. Let's get to removing this. So the brand Generation Clay takes it a step further. Each clay mask is infused with the most ancient and effective of natural detoxing remedies. Just to let you know guys, the good news is this is a cruelty free mask. So that has been washed off. So let's go back in the other room and have a closer inspection of the skin. So I am back where the better lighting is. So here is a close up of my face. <laughs> uh, yeah, so obviously taking a closer look at my face. Obviously, I have imperfections. I am human. So I have melasma on the sides of my face here. I have spots of melasma here as well. Um, I have scarring on my face. So I've got a scar here. I've got scarring here, there. Yeah. <laughs> but like I say, everybody has the imperfections. What do you think? Do you think my face looks a little bit brighter? Um, I'm, I'll pop a side by side here of before I put the mask on. And yeah, comment down below and let me know what you think. What, what do you think? <laughs> um, looking at the picture before and my skin now, I do feel that it is a little bit brighter. Not extremely so. Um, it is a very subtle brightness to the skin. But I wasn't expecting miracles just after one use. Um, but yeah, I'm really, 
I'm really liking the way my skin feels. It doesn't feel dried out. Um, it doesn't feel tight at all. It feels really, really nice. I'm trying to not touch my face too much. Um, and yeah, it has it has a little bit of a glow to it. Um, but yeah, it's a very, very pleasant mask. Like I say, if you are interested in purchasing this, I'll link it down below in the information box. I'll also link the sponges as well that I use to take off the mask, my Rayma sponges. I'll link them down below as well. Um, but yeah, that gets a thumbs up from me. Let me know your thoughts. But that concludes this video. So if you have not already hit that subscribe button, smash that thumbs up button and I will see you in the next one. Bye.